<clears throat> produce is nuclear powered, first of all, by these two things. Has a defense for its engine, right here. And several um, weapons all over the place. This one, for shooting people behind. And then these two, right here, the gray ones, for um, above shooting. It can turn really well, really quite well, and since most of its turns end like, it goes like, swoop, swoop, double turn, and go, it automatically switches um, the direction of the engine automatically when it turns. And that the unique thing about this car, the very unique thing, is that if we look right here and here, it produces a lot of waste and it puts out those wastes in liquid form to create somewhat of an oil slick, or at least something like it. Whereas this car is not as fast, it's twice as deadly. You see it's got two guns that can form as one, it's got bumpers on each side, giant wheels, and this thing conceals a nuclear energy source bigger than the previous cars that can shoot straight up or create like a nuclear explosion and this thing can be tilted in one direction. This also provides for extra fuel. This thing is used for latching onto other cars if it, sorry, if it ever needs to um, latch onto other cars has a unique steering system on like an airplane with only one bar, like a joystick. Um, now, this one is really, really cool because these, whoops, um, these two things fire. This thing is a guard. Um, it's very high off the ground, so it's very hard to hit. And if you'll notice, when it turns, sometimes it'll turn too hard and go like that. In fact, several of the cars will, but this one's most prone to it. And these things will um, sense the shift in gravity and, and increase their weight on the opposite side um, to put it back in position. Or that doesn't have nuclear power, instead it uses a rocket. This guy um, uses this thing that he holds, I don't even have a name for it yet, um, to grab onto other cars and drag them with them, wait for a jump, and then he releases his grip and they fall into wherever they're jumping over. This one is just the referee car and the audience, but still, it makes really good burnouts. Plus, it's got these rocket things at the end. Okay, that's the end.